get the book. What's up, guys? This is Ruby Rambles again, doing a little mobile review. I'm in the car. We got this uh, Arizona green tea, uh, Georgia peach. Sounded pretty good. It's got um, about three servings of 17 grams of sugar each, so it's not too bad. About 210 calories in the whole can. I'm going to go ahead and give it a try. Well, that's pretty good. Jack in the Box and got their new uh, mini tacos, so you get five of these for a dollar. There's just the meat inside of it, no lettuce or anything else. They give you ranch to dip it in. Yeah, those Jack in the Box mini tacos are pretty good. They just kind of taste like a taquito to me. I mean, I like their regular tacos a lot better, but those are pretty good. If you like those crunchy taquitos. Now, the Arizona Georgia peach green tea with ginseng. That has pretty good flavor to it, honestly. It's a really, really good peach flavor, as well as the, you know, the honey and green tea that they put in it. This actually does have 5% juice in it. Some of it is peach, but it looks like predominantly pear juice. But it does come through pretty good. You can kind of taste that, the Arizona uh, green tea, like the... The original one have, but it has a little bit more extra flavor with that peach going on. I think it's a good combination. Now, I'd give this um, an 8 out of 10. I'll probably be buying this again if I see it in stores. Not sure how long it's been in here, but that's my review of the Arizona Georgia Peach Green Tea. This has been Ruby Rambles. Y'all have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time.